everybody. Welcome back to What's Buzzing at the Bee. We've got some exciting new things to show you today. Um, we've kind of, we're past the holiday season for the most part, so we're gonna kind of jump ahead into the new year starting this morning. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you some of our adorable Valentine stuff that we have so far. So we showed you one a couple weeks ago. Um, this one was the, um, the cloth works. This one was XOXO. It's got some really more soft pastel tones and these adorable cars, as well as the cute little puppies. We also have just gotten in another new Valentine's line by Wilmington Prints. This one is Happy Hearts. It definitely has those classic Valentine's colors. So you've got the rich reds, those pinks, and some black and white mixed in there as well with sort of the classic um, hearts. And you've got some of those uh, Valentine words on there as well. I think this one is adorable. You could do some little fabric Valentines out of this one. That would be pretty cute. And we've just got like some other little fun Valentine's things mixed in here as well. Um, so we've got some Kimberbell uh, kits here, um, some little mugs that would be an adorable gift, and just some pre-cuts as well. So if you want to get a head start on your Valentine's projects, we've got that right up front, just right as you come in the door. Um, so if you want to get a head start on those, you can definitely pop by and look, take a look at those. I'm going to go ahead and show you one of our newest kits. So this is confetti. It is a red, white, and blue uh, quilt. It's got more of a modern design to it. And we've got it hanging up right up here. We're gonna have um, our newest kits hopefully available online on our website later this afternoon. So if you wanna take a look at it on there, you can. Um, otherwise, if you wanna pop into the store, um, we have it hanging up for you to see as well. Okay. And we'll go ahead and head over here. We've got some adorable new lines around the table here. So I pulled some up so that we could see some on the table, but we'll go ahead and show around as well. Um, the first one is Get Out and Explore by RJR Fabrics. It's this adorable little sort of camper themed line, very outdoorsy, woodsy, sort of that woodland look to it. Um, you've got sort of those organic color tones, some more of like the rich greens, and you've got this really nice rust there as well. We also have this line here. This one is um, this one is called Heather and Sage by Macauer UK. It's got this beautiful scenic print here. Has almost like a Van Gogh look to it. So this is like the main print and it comes in a couple different colorways. And then we've got some really adorable prints mixed in as well. So the little sheep are pretty adorable. And then this line here, this one is Meadow Side by Lewis and Irene. This one has kind of like a vintage uh, feel to it. It's got some really pretty florals and foliage in there and some really like pretty soft pastel tones to it um, so we've got more of that line right here so it's got kind of the purples it's got these really nice golds and it transitions into this really nice sort of um, grape color and then if we move along you can see more of the heather and sage line so this one also has some really pretty florals and the birds and trees. And then starting here, we've got the rest of the Get Out and Explore line by RJR. This one has a beautiful sort of, looks like thistles. 
So all three of these lines are just around this round table, kind of right as you come in. So you can take a look at those. Um, I chose this pattern here. This is the Nightingale pattern by Lo and Behold. I think, you know, each one of these, all three of them would look fantastic in this pattern. So I kind of just wanted to give an example of what you could do with any, th all three of these. <laughs> okay. And I just wanted to give a little shout out to this kit that we put together as well. So this one is all batiks. They're beautiful, uh, rich, warm tones. Um, and we've got the sample hanging up here in the store as well. It is a really beautiful pattern and those uh, batiks in there are just gorgeous as well. So again, hopefully these ones will be up on our website later today. Um, otherwise, yeah, if you wanna come see this one in person is just absolutely gorgeous. So definitely stop by and take a look. Okay, and we'll just come down here. We've got some of our holiday stuff still here. Just wanted to uh, mention that our Christmas stuff is still on sale. So if you wanna come by, that is still available. Okay, and then we've got this line here. This is from Figo Fabrics. It's called In the Dawn. It is a linen and cotton blend. And it is a gorgeous print. The designer of this line, she did her own linoleum block carving to create all of these prints. So it really does have that gorgeous sort of a stamped look to it. So all of it looks very unique and uh, just absolutely gorgeous. So any of these would be wonderful in maybe a new bag or on the Figo website, they have some free patterns available for that go along with this collection and they're quite unique as well. So you could pop on there and take a look at those. And we'll come right through here. We're gonna end up right at this end cap here. We have the new Kim Deal line uh, through Henry Glass. It has her kind of traditional sort of scrappy look with all the different prints and patterns in the really sort of uh, romantic colors. So you've got the pinks and the burgundies. Um, the name of this line is Chocolate Covered Cherries, so it has that sort of decadent look to it, which is wonderful. So any of, any of these. I've got this um, Log Cabin Block Basics book. It's like a mini uh, a book based on the log cabin technique, so it gives you, you know, different uh, styles, different sizes, different things you could do with a log cabin block. And I have that here because I know the Kim Deal stuff looks just wonderful when you can do it in kind of this sort of scrappy look. So that is an option there. And then we'll just come through here. Um, we've got all the rest of our Civil War stuff through here. So I'll just come around to the front here. And we have our uh, January bag of the month available already. Um, since we're gonna be hitting that first of the month, we thought we would show it today. So it is this insulated zipper tote and it is made using the laminated cotton. So it has that smooth finish, sort of that waterproof, uh, look to it so you could maybe use it as a lunch bag that would be kind of i think the most common use for it i think you could also use it as a little tote um, to use it for like a toiletry bag you know you could put your stuff in there because if anything accidentally spills you're going to be covered because it's all just easily you can just wipe it off so that's really nice so we've got all of the kits available and it does have the insole bright in between, so you can use it as a lunch bag. It'll keep everything nice and fresh. 
So you can do um, the kits that we already have put together for you. We do also still have some of the laminated cotton in some other prints as well. So this adorable fruits and veg. And then we've got some yardage as well that you could use. And as we're going into the new year, we are going to be having our used machine sale um, starting the second. So if you want to get a machine at the start of the year, you know, get a new machine for the new year, um, you can stop by. We're going to have all of them in the classroom. We're going to have people uh, over there. So if you have any questions about any of the machines, if you want to try them out, you can definitely do that. Um, so yeah, we're going to have the used machine sale starting next week, which we're very excited about. Um, I think that is going to be it for today. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for, you know, anybody who uh, spent part of their holiday with us. Thank you so much. And uh, we'll see you next year.